Radio SI je to esen v idilični prekmurski pokrajini pripravil prvo srečanje tujcev, ki živijo, delajo ali študirajo v Sloveniji, poimenovano International Club. We thought it was about time that Radio Slovenia International really tried to find out in Slovenia who of all the nationalities that live here would like to be part of a, a group, uh, get to know more about us so we could target what we do to all of the international people in Slovenia. And there are lots of them. We have some 30 to 40 nations here. I think it's the fact that they can see that there really are quite a lot of foreigners in Slovenia and that they have something in common, that is that they listen to Radio Slovenia International. In šele, ko se na kupu zberejo tisti, ki jih je pot tako ali drugače zanesla v naše kraje, se zavimo, da v naši prelepi deželici živijo ljudje iz vseh koncev zemljske oble. The name Slovenia has love in the middle, you know? So I'm here because of love. Uh, yeah, I met my wife in Ghana. That was 2005, when she went to do some work there for one NGO. And uh, I was member of this NGO as well. So we actually met and... Uh, I visited Slovenia first in 2007. When I went back, I saw, you know, I saw some changes and they moved on from there. And today I'm, uh, I'm here, living here now. No, we live in Lendeva, but uh, my wife, she works, works in Lutomer in uh, the gymnasia, teaching English to the locals. She's an English speaker. Well, we watched a television program in England and they were shown places around the world that you could by property in and I saw Slovenia and I kind of fell in love with it. <laughs> so we, we just sold up, came here, looked around and stayed. Kljub različnim kulturam, rasam in navadam pa so vse združile prisne prekmurske kulinarične dobrote in običaji. When they arrived they were testing the wine and uh, now they're having lunch which of course is typical for this region, Bograt, which has been served in pottery pot. <laughs> uh, and then uh, afterwards we're going to do several things from pottery making to candle making, visiting the vineyard, connecting grapes, also walking on grapes. So um, in the end there will be a production of some wine. Yeah, Bograt is the first one who has a lot of In takrat vlado krešil na mije povabu in sem zelo dobro res jedel, ampak ko sem prišel v Ljubljano, pa sem imel težave, ker se je bilo feferon noter. Ker slovenci veljamo za pridan narod, so tudi tujci morali pojedi, po prijeti za delo. Vele poslanikom je odlično šlo od rok obiranje grozdja. Zdaj je zelo, kako vse je v Sloveniji. Zdaj je testiti? Vse. Well, yes, yes, I did, actually, and uh, very aromatic and very nice. My question is, you know, you develop all this wine and you drink it up all, you know, of it, you know, because, because certainly that's one of the best kept secrets in the world, it's about the quality of the wine that is processed here. Basically, I, I know Slovenians love it, definitely, but it's uh, hard to know if this can be found, you know, in distant places of the world, like the country I come from. In tako smo se o dobro varovanih domačih vinskih skrivnostih pozanimali kar pri strokovnjakih. Ena Marofo v prvi vrsti najdejo dobra vina. To so vina, ki na nek način izražajo identiteto Goričkega. Predvsem želimo v naših vinih izraziti zemljo, ki jo imamo tukaj na razpolago in pa klimo. Čeprav se tujci v Sloveniji odlično počutijo, smo jih povprašali o prvih vtisih in presenečenih o prihodu v našo deželo. So some, some things are different. For example, yeah. tractors. Everybody yeah. has a tractor. Yeah. You know, which in England, if you're a farmer, you have a tractor. Yeah. But here, it's, everybody has everyone one. has it. And of course, it's your love of salad. It's your national dish. I don't care. Yeah. Bog Ratch is on its salad. Yeah. It's one of my biggest shocks ever when I came to Slovenia, you know? Because I'm, I'm an environmentalist artist, you know, like I paint trash bins, you know? And when I came here, everything was so clean. I was like, do I have a project here or what? You know? Because there are no trash bins. <laughs> there are no trash bins on the streets, and yeah? It was really difficult to find. There is, there is no trash, you know? I'm a trash bin artist. 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 Potovala sem veliko po svetu in res lahko rečemo. Slovenija je zelena in čista in res smo lahko ponosni na to. No. Ponosni pa smo lahko tudi na našo kulturo in prijaznost, saj vsi člani International kluba zatrjujejo, da se v Sloveniji resnično odlično počutijo.